After a week in Canada, the ATP World Tour has travelled 820 miles south over the border to Cincinnati, on the banks of the Great Ohio River, for the Western and Southern Financial Group Masters. This is the seventh ATP Masters 1000 event of the year, the last one on North American soil and, thanks to its proximity in the calendar to the US Open, it is a significant tournament that features every one of the top players. Roger Federer lost his world number one status to Rafael Nadal here 12 months ago, but titles at the French Open and Wimbledon earlier this year saw him return to the top of the rankings. The top seed won the title here in 2005 and 2007, and after a surprise loss to Joe Wilfred Songer in Montreal, he will be looking to return to winning ways this week as he prepares to defend the US Open crown. For the first time in four years, the number two ranking is now held by a player not called Roger Federer or Rafael Nadal. It is, for now, Andy Murray's. After his tournament victory in Montreal, he managed to break the stranglehold at the top of the game. His run to the number two spot started to gain momentum here last year when he won the title. He comes back as the defending champion and the informed player on the tour. Thanks to Murray, Rafael Nadal now finds himself in the unfamiliar position of being the third best player on the planet. The Spaniard has been injured for much of the summer and was unable to defend his French Open and Wimbledon crowns. Now free from tendonitis, he is expected to be a major force here. World number four Novak Djokovic had been overshadowed in recent months by the trio ahead of him in the rankings. But the Serbian was runner-up here last year has won all of the other North American hardcore titles and will be expected to be a serious title contender. And then there's the local favourite, Andy Roddick. The American has won the title here twice before and will thrive on the home support. There may be others who surprise, but whatever happens, a hot and steamy week of tennis awaits.